to you're serious about. Yeah, I'm serious. Yeah, he's, he's, got got a, he's got his own company. I mean, he's the guy you want to meet, not on your team. I want you to meet him on a second for me. Yeah, because everybody's always saying, oh, I can't. Do I know you? Of course. <laughs> Don't you remember? <laughs> I, I take it I should. Silly. It's me. We were engaged. You were engaged. <laughs> I, I beg your pardon? Letting you go. That was the biggest mistake of my life. And it's a mistake I've had to live with for six years, but I've put it behind me now. And I just hope that you can put it behind you, too. I've missed you. <laughs> oh, that's very nice. That was very good. Greatly appreciate that. Good. good. Wow. The day I left you, I just drove and drove. I drove all day and all that night. I just kept driving. I stopped at this old country church, and the pastor let me in, and I sat. In the very first pew where we would have sat on our wedding day. I can't believe I remembered that. Although, I mean, I should, I wrote it. But that was seven years ago, and you're quoting it verbatim. I'm flattered, I think, or frightened. <laughs> One or the other. What's your name? Betty Sizemore. You, what'd you write? I'm Lila Branch. I'm the producer. Uh -huh. <laughs> I have to admit, you had me going there. Oh. <laughs> you're better than most of them anyway. Uh. Yeah. Do you have a headshot? Wait a second. So, what happens next, Betty? Are you sure you... Well, why not? What what does happen next, Betty? Well, David came out to uh, do his residency, and then he met Leslie. No, 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 no. We know all of that. We want to know what happened to you, Betty. Oh, oh. Well... I married a car salesman. <laughs> <laughs> really? You were, you were, you were dumped. We're car salesman, George. Yeah, yeah car salesman. Why did you call him George? Why did I call him George? Yeah, David, tell us about the car salesman. Oh, right, right. Well, you're, um, you're talking about, uh, Fred there. Dell. Dell. Dell, yeah. Uh, Dell, he was amazing. No, Fred. He was, I mean, this guy, talk about salesman, he could sell anything to anybody at any time. <laughs> amazing. You Del? I don't know how to tell you this, but Del and I go way back. We went to school together. As a matter of fact, he saved my life. Oh my gosh. Like two more minutes in that freezing cold water, and I swear to God I would have drowned, but. Del. Del jumped in and he he grabbed me and he just he pulled me out. <laughs> it was amazing. Well, hold on, I'm having a moment here. I lost touch with him after that, but I still owe him. He never said anything. God, that is unbelievable. It's funny. It's just what I was thinking. I know. I can't tell you how much it hurt me to hear that you married him. Oh, I'm so sorry. I tried to tell myself at first it was for the best, that there was some sort of reason for it. Well, Del... I was young and, and stupid and scared. You never even gave us a chance. I know. I can't tell you how many times I, I tell myself that same thing. Are you, are you really crying right now? <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just kind of playing along. But what are you doing, George? Why does he keep calling you George? I don't know. Listen, Betty, I'm sure you'll understand that David is a very busy man, so we really have to go now. Let's close your meeting. We gotta get to this uh, previous engagement, but uh, oh. it was good. <laughs> it was so great. All right.